right, welcome back to the Rope Access Channel. My name is Alex and this video I'll be showing you how to ascend and descend the rope in your ascender. First off, we attach our backup to our backup line. Next step is attaching the rope to the chest ascender. If I want to climb up the rope, I need a foot loop to stand up in, so I take my hand ascender, attach it to the rope, do up all the carabiners. Put my foot in the foot loop. And for the first step, I find it easy to hold the bottom of the rope and step up and pull the slack through the chest ascender. Sit back down and now it's time to organize everything a little bit. So I drape the tail end of the rope over my foot. I use my other foot to step on it and I squeeze it. So now when I stand up, it slides through the rope very easy. Let's sit back down. Very easy. So do that again. Move the handle the sander up. Squeeze the rope between my feet. Stand up. Sit back down. One more. Manage my back up. Slide my foot back up. Boom. That's it. So now if I want to climb down, I have to have my ascender at the level of my head. I stand up a little bit and I push the cam of the chest ascender down. So I take the little teeth out of the rope. And then I step back down. I drape the rope over my left leg so there's as less as friction as possible. I stand up, push the cam down, sit back down, let go. Move the handle to sender down, stand up, and sit back down. Move the handle to sender down, stand up a little bit. And this way I can climb down until I'm at the ground. So this video is sponsored by Industrial Klimmen. As you can see behind me, there's a beautiful training center where we teach all kinds of different working at heights methods. We can do working at height according to GWO, or we can do rope access training according to Arata, and anything in between. We can use the towers to do uh, telecom cell phone network work, or we can have fake silos, or we can do confined space training. So basically any training regards to working safely at height. Besides the practical stuff, there's a beautiful physical store next door where you can come in and try out all the climbing gear that you're interested in. If you're not able to physically come here, you can visit the web store and you will find the link down in the description. Also, if you, if you have any questions, just contact the people of the company and they can answer anything that you would like to know. So I have a right down back at the ground. I take off the handle to sender, clean it up, put it back on my harness, take, a rope, take the rope out of the Chest sender, take my back up off and give myself a little bit of room to move. So that's it for climbing up and down, ascending and descending the rope in your ascender. If you like this video, please let me know in the comments. If you have any question, you can ask them there. Subscribe, hit that notification bell, and of course, give me a thumbs up. In the next video, we'll be going from our descender to my ascender while suspended in the ropes. I will be going both ways. I will see you there. Stay connected.